Yes, always have to have a little bit of Tartaria. You know, <clears throat> we already know that there's lots of quite nasty people on Facebook. You know, you'll put some innocent sort of post out and then somebody will come in and say something horrible and upset you because you think, what the hell? But on the other hand, there's lots of little warriors there always putting posts out. And I like a lot of the posts. Anyway, we're looking at this. We'll just flick through a few pictures. Maybe these were from when we were mined. They're old, but they're not as old as you think they are. I don't know. Maybe they're what they are, but, um, yes. I think that Buck's got that right as well. We claimed them, they were already here, and now they've gone. And that's quite interesting as well, isn't it? Let's move on to the next picture. I think the person's got that wrong. What they are is these are, well, I don't know about, yeah, these are burial chambers. They buried. And they said originally there would have been water there and they were they were buried near the sea so their souls could go off. They were crypts. I mean, in a way, it's a good way, isn't it? Just put them over there. We'll put them all in those rocks. But they're the Raymonds, probably. Looks like that's two pictures of that one, sorry. Oh, no, it's a bit of writing. But those, yeah, tombs. Where people are buried, were buried. They're not there now. Yes, look at that one. Hardly anybody there on that one. Do you know what? I think this is what England is like. My lovely Mickey told me that a friend of his went on a helicopter flight. I think he was the pilot. can't remember now. And he was going up England to Scotland. And they were talking. And then they got his friend said basically he felt that England was hollow in the middle. And I think if you see any flooding, you know when they show flooding? If it covers the UK, you'll see a lot of England disappears because... I live, remember I've told you, down here in England on these Wessex Downs and Inkpen Hill, or say that one, is the highest point in southern England. This isn't England, this is an island in Japan, but I'm just saying. So I live up here on this plateau called the Wessex Downs, but it's full of things like this. And when you go down to Southampton, you go down a long hill to get there. And obviously this is Scotland. And in the middle, England is quite hollow. Look at that one. Wow. Anyway, let's move on. Oh, same picture. Oh, yes, I put this message in from James. So everybody can read that very interesting point. Well, they totally lied about everything. It kind of makes sense if that was the four rivers. But then they have put it the other way round. Because they always show it's, it's above the UK, not below. Mm. Anyway, on to the next bit now. Are we going? Oh, done. Oh, we've done that one. Yeah, here we go. When I was doing a video the other day, it was talking about the heart and how electric it was. We have an electric pulse in our heart, an electric pulse in our brains, and we make this electromagnetic uh, field around ourselves. And it's in a video, and the guy says, oh, this is how we like or not like people, because our hearts know, because of that electromagnetic field that goes out, whether people like us or not. 
And then I thought about things, because, you know, then we'll just go through some of the pictures. So there you go. We know there's an ele electromagnetic field around us. So it says it's 100 times greater strength than the field in the brain. But the brain has one as well. So, it can go out up to five feet out of your body. Wow, and you can't see it. That's interesting, isn't it? I suppose it all makes sense, doesn't it? So we have an aura as well, which has colours in. I think that's what it is, that they can see these colours. Maybe that's what your aura is, is your electromagnetic field. Yes. That is for something different, but it just, it was where I was going. Like if we have an electromagnetic field and then you learn to shut it off, you turn off the magnetic field. Yes, is these the kind of things that they do to us? Maybe they don't have to, you know, the stories on the uh, television are about bombs, you know, rockets going to the not moon, the, with the not astronauts, but um, maybe they don't have to do any of those things to weaponize for us, they can just use different things because they have to affect our electromagnetic fields. Maybe that's why the towers are there, isn't it, to do that thing. Yes, there you go. Some of them might be the same. They're not actually the same thing, but they're very similar answers because they only give you so many. Yes. I was just wondering if we all have, I find it crazy to think that we live in this electric place. So the sun's electric, the free energy air is electric, the trees are electric, the ground is electric. And then we are electric. We have an electric pulse in our hearts and our brains. And we also have an electromagnetic field. 
Maybe that is what they try to destroy all the time. With whatever it is, those towers, the pharmaceutical, the television. Because I was really shocked when that person who made the television, the, the tubes inside, that originally he was trying to talk to dead people and then we call it a television tell a lie on a vision i mean there you go i mean what other word do you need tell a lie on a vision tell a lie vision when you've got that thing and they're talking to people on the other side and then they put them in televisions and then what you do is you call them programs so it's programming you on the channels which would then go with the tubes to talking to the dead people what do we muster through those televisions or what are they able to put through those televisions that you're not seeing i mean i thought when i filmed it i can't find that video of course that you could see faces but i'm just saying if we've got an electromagnetic field if you turn off the current you shut down the magnetic field is that what all the NPCs and zombies are all about? Those that can't take their eyes off the television and are watching every bit of news and all the, what is it, the uh, drama, the uh, soap opera drama of the royal family. And I thought that was just a little bit interesting when you think. It's like we're machines, isn't it? But um, I thought that was very interesting. What's your thoughts to all this?